5G will allow automation at unprecedented scale. And with this automation, we'll be able to improve safety, productivity, and efficiency across all levels of government, whether this is in warehouses, manufacturing, also out in forward operating bases. It's important that also we harden these networks and add the additional functionality that government customers need. Doing this in a way that preserves the economies of scale and the benefits of COTS technologies is where the importance of a partnership comes in. As you can see here, this is our source, security orchestration, analytics and response, which actually helps with predicting the attack, preventing the attack, detecting the attack and responding. So we are using AI and machine learning capabilities in order to provide next generation security for mission critical networks. A lot of the Department of Defense customers I've talked with are very excited about 5G. They see the applications, they see the use cases, they're ready for it. Nokia itself has all the way from the 5G down to the front hall, mid hall, long hall, switching, aggregation and routing layer from the network managed under a common management plane. Whether it's personal safety, high bandwidth communication needs, or thousands of small IoT devices which only transmit and burst. What we need to be able to do is segment that traffic and bring it back at a high reliable, high speed network to make sure that it stays mission critical from point A to point B in the network. Well, I think the U.S. government is doing all of the right things to speed up. DOD is investing in these 5G use cases, so what they're trying to do is take commercial technology and, and drive those in the DOD world. So what they're saving is all the time and money spent in developing those use cases and then translating those to a DOD environment. I think we're doing the right things. We're positioning our technology, I think, in an event like AFCO West, where we can demonstrate the technologies is one way to doing that. If you understand Bell Labs' heritage and their history, they are truly our, our foremost R&D arms. And so I'm really encouraged by the feedback we've gotten leading with 5G and what the customers have been telling us.